Hi there, my name is Madison Reinhard and I created a bioregional map of the area where I live. So I live out in the country surrounded by cornfields on every side of where I live. So there's cornfields in the north, the west, the south, and then over to the east there's um, some houses and other people's property, but there's a lot of fields out in that area as well. So I have a pond in my backyard, and the pond is surrounded by a hill along the perimeter, so that kind of keeps the water in. And then there's also stone around the rim of the pond as well. On top of the hill, there are a bunch of pine trees that were planted to kind of create some privacy, and also they're just starting to look really nice. In front of the pond, there's a lot of sand, but then everywhere else in the yard, it's just grass. So in all directions until you get to the road. Um, the X right here represents my home where I live, and the N represents the north direction. There are a lot of deer and birds and squirrels, ducks, geese, frogs, fish, coyotes, and rodents that live in my area. A lot of the deer um, like to hide in the fields, so there's a lot of deer in the area. And then you'll find squirrels everywhere as well. We also have bluegill and catfish in our pond. Um, one bad human aspect in my area would pertain to factory farming. If you don't know what factory farming is, it's the mass production of animals for meat consumption. So a lot of factory farms in the area will have hundreds of cows at a time mass produced just for cheap meat to be sold. And those farmers also inevitably farm their crops in the area as well. We have some friends who own this one right here, but that's not a factory farm. Um, and it really upsets me to see the animals endure this in my area, and it also creates a really potent, pungent smell in the area of manure, and yeah, that's not very appealing. Um, one good aspect of my area is that a lot of people in the area do a lot of their own gardening. So this represents the garden we have, but a lot of people in the area also garden. In my garden, we have strawberries and we have a raspberry patch. We grow a lot of our own vegetables as well. And my dad also recently got his own honeybees, so he produces his own honey as well. So altogether, this represents the area where I live. Thank you for listening.